Good morning internet. It is quarter to eight in the morning and welcome back to the channel. Welcome here in British Columbia, Canada. Somewhere on the countryside on some farm. I'm having a, an easy breakfast at this morning with that amazing, amazing view. It is beautiful weather today again. So I'm really happy because I'm riding over 400 kilometers today, 430 or something. So it's quite a lot of riding today. So yeah, I'm just really looking forward. I'm riding today to a place called um, Kilimat. Kitimat. 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 Kitimat, it's called. So I'm now right here, just southwest of Burns Lake. And I'm gonna ride towards Houston. That will probably be dirt. And then I will have to ride tar for a little bit. And then I'm gonna end up here in Kitimat today. Oh, it's so pretty here. <laughs> it's also, there are so many mosquitoes here. And they are huge. I guess when it comes to mosquitoes, this is only a teaser of what is awaiting me in Alaska. <laughs> I believe uh, the majority of the world population of mosquitoes loves living in Alaska. So, but anyway, see that when we get there. Oh, what a lovely place. I'm a bit jealous of the family that lives here. <laughs> it's just amazing. And uh, like all the way in the distance, there's a house there. So I asked them, oh, is that, uh, is that your house? Like, oh no, that's, that's the neighbors. And it's like all the way in the distance. So yeah, you don't live completely alone here. But what an amazing place. Okay, where do I remember going? Kitimat, Kitimat. Oh, I didn't put in. I'm taking another way out now. <laughs> they asked me, why did you take that road? I was like, I don't know. <laughs> it was on my GPS and I thought that seemed to be the quickest way. But I guess uh, this is more the official route. That I was actually supposed to take. Oh, now I'm passing probably their house, yeah. Oh, I hope the dogs are not gonna come after me. They have 10 of these really big, what are they called now? Those, those aren't they the Turkish wolf dogs or something? Oh yeah, oh, there they are. They're huge and they're protecting the cattle against wolves. Oh, oh well, wow, that actually looks like a wolf, wolf dog. Hi guys! Oh, there's a ghost. See, is anyone home? I can say goodbye. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's me. I'm leaving. So I just wanted to say bye. I just followed this road. Okay. Is the dog okay? <laughs> oh, you guys have puppies. Oh, they're so cute. <laughs> uh, Anatolia. Oh, no, Anatolian. Ah, yeah, yeah. Turkish. Turkish uh, yeah, Turkish. Dog. Yeah. They're amazing. <laughs> Terrifying when they bark at you, <laughs> but amazing. You need them for the goats. For the goats. Yeah. For against wolves. So eat in the mountains. That's the guardian for the dogs. For the for the goats. Yeah. Protected for wolves, coyotes. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they're really, really good dogs. But yeah. they're so cute when they're still puppies. <laughs> yeah, papa. The father from the little ones. Oh, it's the, it's the father. Oh. It's very cute. Do you like the place? Yeah, it's yeah. really nice. It's a shame I can't stay longer. But um, no, I really enjoyed my stay. Slept like a baby, so good. all is good. Oh, I, I forgot to switch off the, the battery. Sorry, I switched it on this morning for the Wi-Fi, but I forgot to switch it off. Yeah. Uh, the Wi-Fi, when you switch uh, off the, the power, yeah. you have three hours time. 
Ah, okay, okay. Yeah, I switched yeah. it off last night, yeah. but then I switched it on this morning for Wi-Fi. But now I forgot. Do you want me to go back and switch it off? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. No. Oh. Oh. Okay. okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. Have a nice trip. Now you go. Through. I go today to Kitimat. Ah, Kitimat. Yeah. Yeah. So nice meeting you. Yeah. Take care. He's not gonna come after me, is he? Yeah. He's gonna chase me or not? No. no. Okay. <laughs> Usually dogs, they all come after me on the bike, but okay. Great, thank you, take care, bye. <laughs> right. Horses, goats. Another doggy. Yeah, they need to... Uh, do the job, protect the farm animals against uh, wolves and whatnot. Mm. Ah, yeah, this is the main, main road, I guess. Let's go on course. 445 k's. snow cap mounted in the distance there. Oh, there's a lot of snow on there still. Uh, it's places like this, you know, if you look at this, I'm like, wow, I would spend an entire summer here, but I don't think I could live here year round because the winters here, they're long, they're cold, snowy. Like, I don't even know if these roads, like if they keep them open, surely they must be, but I just cannot imagine how life in winter is in places like this. And I'm not even that far north, you know, it's only going to get well, worse, I guess, uh, the more I get to Alaska. But already here, I, I can't imagine how it's like to live here in winter time. But yeah, summer times are nice. Really long days, you know. It stays light until... 11 at night, it's amazing. Fast flowing here too. See that uh, big mountain over there? I actually think Kitty Mat. Let's zoom out. So Kitty Mat is pretty much straight over there on the other side of the mountains. And I was looking for a road that would go get us straight there. But uh, now that I've seen all these mountains with snow on top, that definitely explains why. I have to make a big uh, loop around it because there are no roads that lead over those mountains. Look, a deer. Hi. 
Hi there. <laughs> I was just casually crossing the road. I'm now in a town called Smithers. And since I didn't have much for breakfast, I'm gonna see if I can uh, have a stop here and eat something. Subway, McDonald's. I'm hoping on something a little bit more inspiring to eat. That looks nice. Perfect. Oh, this looks amazing. Check this out. I've got a poke bowl and a cappuccino. So yeah, a good dose of veggies is exactly what I needed. So I'm gonna enjoy my well, late breakfast slash lunch. Oh, it's just such nice weather to be riding and to have a stop here outside. It's just oh, so nice. All right, that was really, really good. So time to get moving. It's still about 250 k's, I think. So not there yet. There's another glacier just uh, in between the mountain tops there. That's a glacier. Spectacular! <laughs> Look how high these mountains are. I am going to try and find a place to stay here in Kitimat for tonight. So that was it for today. Um, I hope you liked this video. I certainly had a really, really nice ride. It's quite relaxing, nothing crazy. Um, anyway, if you liked it, please give me a big thumbs up, subscribe down below, and then I'll see you in the next video. Here.